There was no obstacle so great that Phileas Fogg could not overcome it. When Mr. Fogg told his friends at the club that he could journey around the world in a mere 80 days, they laughed. <laughs> <laughs> it's impossible, they said. On the contrary, he said calmly, it's quite possible. I shall return, he told them, at this exact time on the 16th of September. And so it was exactly a quarter before nine o'clock on that Saturday morning that Phileas Fogg left for his journey round the world in 80 days. No one believed that Mr. Fogg would make it. 80 days couldn't be enough time. But at one second before a quarter of nine o'clock on September 16th, into the club door stepped Phileas Fogg, and in his calm voice he said, my friends, here I am. But Phileas, cried his friends, this is the 81st day since you left. Gentlemen, said Mr. Fogg, you forget that I crossed the international date line. It is here that the new day begins. By crossing in an easterly direction, I lost an entire day. So you see, I have indeed come around the world in exactly 80 days. The end. Around the World in 80 Days by Jules Verne is one of my all-time favorites. Come on. Nobody could actually get that far that fast unless they were in a jet airplane. It's impossible. A lot of things are possible. If you have the right attitude, you can find ways around most any obstacle. She's right, as always. It's all about having a positive outlook. But of course, some things are still impossible. Like going around the world in 80 days without, as you say, a jet. I'd give every pie in this wagon to anyone who could do that. If anybody could do it, Strawberry Shortcake could. She can find ways around any kind of obstacle. Uh, Ginger? Yes, yes, I know. But still, she couldn't possibly make that trip. Uh, she could do it with her eyes closed. If she didn't make it... Oh! I'd expect something in return. How about every berry in Strawberry Land? Why, yes. I guess that's a fair deal. What would I do without these kids? I'll be back in 80 days, but I don't think you will be. Take good care of our berry plants. Have a nice trip. Ginger Snap, what did you just do? Uh, said something I shouldn't have, didn't I? I'll say. And the worst part is, he's right. You'll never make it back in time, Strawberry. Maybe not, but maybe, just maybe, I will. Pretty cool, huh? Ginger Snap had it in her garage. Can you believe it? You gotta be kidding, right? You really think you're going around the world in this old thing? Hey, I made that myself. It'll go anywhere. Anywhere, you say? Hmm. But is it safe? Sure it is. It can fly in the air and float in the water. Well, it is an amazing piece of machinery. Ah, but what's this? These bolts are a bit loose. Better fix it. We wouldn't want to have an accident. Here, let me give it a gentle tap. Yes, that should do it. to work like a charm now. Hey, what did you do? Strawberry Sharky Claude. Whoa, what's happening here? Oh, how dreadful. Ah, oh, well, you might as well give up. No way you'll make it now. Strawberry, get up here and stop this thing. I'm coming. 
coming, Peppermint. Bon voyage. Good luck. See you soon. Here, here. Take my hand. Thanks, Peppermint. Now get us down, please, Strawberry. I want to go home. What happened here? Nothing's working. I have to fix all this. Just turn it off. Make us land. We're going to be fine, Peppermint. We're already over the ocean. I guess that means I'm coming along for the ride, huh? Welcome aboard, shipmate Peppermint. We could be anywhere. We could just be flying around in circles. We'll be okay. Besides the panels, I've been watching the stars. There's the bright berry star of the east. It looks like we're headed right where we want to be. Don't cry. Don't be blue. We're sailing toward a day that's new. Who knows all the joys in store when you're sailing toward tomorrow? The sun will shine so bright and we'll be guided by the stars at night. They remind us we can dream of more cause we're sailing toward tomorrow. So don't be scared or Just hang on a little longer, Peppermint. See, out there? We've made it! It's Paris, where Crepe Suzette lives. What's the matter? I think we're out of gas. Hold on! We'll never make it now. No. We'll find a way around this little obstacle. We'll find a new way to travel, the same as Phileas Fogg did. Ah, Paris, we've made it. But this is costing us a fortune. What's the point? The berries of the garden are worth far more. So quit complaining. We have work to do. Work? There's that word again. Bonjour! Entrez, s'il vous plaît. Hello, Crepes Suzette. Strawberry shortcake? Is it you? Bonjour, Crepes. Hello. You remember Peppermint Fizz, don't you? Mais oui. Bien sûr. Of course. Bonjour, Peppermint. Please, come tell me what brings you here. The next thing we knew, we were flying across the ocean, headed toward Paris. What a remarkable journey you've had. Well, it's been a long one anyway. We've been going for weeks. Oh, Peppermint, it hasn't been so bad. After
After all, look how far we've already come. Yeah, but I doubt we'll ever make it the rest of the way. You know what I do on long trips? I bring along a bag of small geeks and reward myself with one at the beginning of each day. Let me make one up just for you. I'm afraid we can't stay very long, Crepes. The controls on the boat were broken and we lost some time getting here. We need to make up at least a day. Thank you, Crepe Suzette. Is there any other way to get from here to there? Oh, yes. There's a train running that route every afternoon. If you early, you can still catch it. I knew we could count on you, Crepe Suzette. You see, Peppermint? We're making good time again. You just have to keep that positive attitude. Looks like the sheep want to graze on the tracks today. It'll take forever to get this cleared up. Guess we're not going to make it after all. Remember, Peppermint, there are ways around any obstacle. Even this? Yes. If we work on the problem a little at a time, we'll be able to handle it. We can't move these sheep all at once, but we can move them one at a time. Come on, little fella. Follow me. You see? It just seemed like a big obstacle. When we took it a little at a time, it wasn't so bad. What do I keep telling you? She can overcome any obstacle you put in her path. It's time for plan B. <sighs> no way we're gonna move that a little at a time. It'd take years. There are other ways to travel, like that. Oh, Strawberry, tell me you're kidding, please. Come on, we don't have any time to lose. What's she up to now? We saw that tree down to stop her in her tracks. On to plan C. Just look at this, Peppermint. We're halfway through the jungle already, and we still have 40 days left. You know, I should reward myself. Like Creep Suzette said. Hey, looky, it's a camera. Give us a smile, Strawberry. We've made it. We're out of the jungle. Thanks for your help, my friend. And thank you, nice elephant. Strawberry Shortcake, is that you? I know that voice. Tea Blossom! <coughs> so you see, now we have to find a ship to take us the rest of the way back. If we can get home in three weeks, that rotten old pie man won't get the berry fields. I'm sure we'll find what you need. <coughs> my friends are looking for a very fast ship to take them back to Strawberry Land. Old Soggy Sal is one of the finest and fastest boats that ever sailed. It sounds perfect. Do you have room for us? We surely do. We'll sail with the morning wind. If you want to come, be here before the sun. All right. Thanks. Thanks for your help, Tea Blossom. Oh, it was my pleasure. Come back again when you have time to stay longer. You got it. <laughs> Thanks for everything. I know it's been a long trip, Peppermint, but we'll be home soon. Are we going to make it in time? The way I have it figured, we'll get there in exactly 80 days. Oh, the poor dears. They actually think we're taking them home. It'll be a lot longer than 80 days when they get back. You know, Strawberry, for the very first time, I really, truly believe we're going to make it. Something's wrong, Peppermint. The bright berry star of the east ought to be there, not behind us. Maybe you're looking at the wrong star. There's a lot of them up there. Maybe. We'll know better when the sun rises. I was right. We were headed south. But why? Those fishermen said we were going to Strawberry Land. We better go talk to them. 
I'm sorry, little one, but I don't have time for talk. It's you, and you too. Why, yes, it is. So good of you to drop in. And good luck with the rest of your trip. <laughs> I can't believe how terrible those two are. They abandoned us on this deserted beach to stop us from getting back to Strawberry Land. Well, it's not over yet. Well, now where are we? I'm not sure, but there's something very familiar about this place. Strawberry Shortcake? Tangerina? Hi there! Tangerina Torta! Is there anywhere you don't have a friend? What an amazing journey! I can't believe you've come so far. Trouble is, we have a long way to go and only a couple of days to get there. I'm beginning to think we may not make it. You don't have a rocket ship laying around, do you? I'm afraid I don't have one of those. But I have a motor scooter you can use. Cool! Perfect! We're almost there now, Peppermint! But, Strawberry, it's 8.35. We only have 10 more minutes. Don't worry, Peppermint. What now? I don't know. I got it! Creep Suzette's gift bag! What are you doing, Peppermint? Just overcoming another obstacle. That's the right attitude, Peppermint! Well then, I think we can agree they aren't coming back in time. We've won fair and square, and the berries are ours. Yeah, I guess you're right. Hey, hey, hey! Hold it! Look over there! You're here a full day late. This is the 81st day since she left. Those are the breaks, dear. I'm afraid you're wrong. You see, we crossed the international date line here in the middle of the ocean. That's where the new day starts. So that makes today the 80th day, not the 81st. No, can't be. Tell me she's wrong. She's right, as usual. Come along, dear. We have some pies for you. You've won them fair and square. No, but thank you very much. That wasn't why I made the journey. Then why did you do it? To show that I could. To show I could overcome all the obstacles I faced. But you weren't supposed to make it. It was impossible. It was quite possible. I knew all along this was going to happen. I knew she'd pull it off. She always does. Are you coming or aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> well, you did it, Strawberry Shortcake. You made it around the world in 80 days. It was a fantastic trip, but I'm very glad to be back home. Home is where the heart is, that's what people say. Home's what makes it special when you get to go away. You can travel new horizons. You can sail to distant shores. The home is where the heart is. Home is where you come from. Home is who you are. Home gives you the courage to decide to journey far. And wherever the journey takes you, you'll remember all the One of all. We may meet new faces, see just every sight we can. But there's 
There's always something special about the place it all began. Home's what you come home to. Home is what you dream of. Home is where the start is. Home is where the heart is. Cause home is Keep <laughs> 